Today we're talking about how to stream on TikTok. Now streaming on TikTok is very popular just because the algorithm is definitely the best algorithm you can get in terms of getting organic reach and engagement. So let's go ahead and talk about the ways. There's a few ways, obviously certain criteria and all of that. Now TikTok does switch around all this criteria. Number one, which is the main one, is getting yourself a stream key. I myself have over 250,000 followers, but I still don't have a stream key. And that would be the easiest format that you do see where you see everybody streaming in actual vertical video meaning that they're editing in their actual software their streaming software which is either obs or streamlabs obs they utilize a stream key on their pc and tiktok somehow gives you that stream key randomly i don't know some people have less followers than i do and they have a stream key some people have way more in order to get that stream key so it just kind of rolls out randomly so if you have a respectable amount of followers just check that out that's the first option that's like the most legit way that you always see everybody doing it in the vertical format on how they're putting their camera and that and a live stream not just in creating content so stream key is option number one so double check that and you can double check that in the live section or in the pc uh version of tiktok just log into tiktok on your computer or something so stream key is the first aspect option number two is going to be your screen sharing your mobile gaming so there's a mobile gaming option when you go into your live section of your tiktok on your phone now this one gets a little bit trickier some people have it also and some people don't uh, it basically in the live section you just kind of go one more to the right or yeah you go to the right and it'll say uh mobile gaming now you have to be sharing it's going to be a screen share anything that pops up on your phone so what people do in order to actually quote unquote stream is that they go into the twitch app and they share this now 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 there's a, there's a couple of things you have to do after this so if you're sharing the twitch app on your phone while you're doing the mobile gaming on the screen sharing you have to it, it duplicates and it has an echo and volume it has your actual live volume of you speaking through the phone and then also if you have a microphone like this if you're streaming on twitch obviously it's going to be showing that volume too so in order to do that you got to mute the volume two ways you can do that one you either put the phone in a whole nother room but it's harder to read the chat you can't really read it uh anyway because it's going to be pulling up your twitch chat instead anything that's on your phone is going to be pulling up instead so one way is that you put the phone in another room you read your chat on a on a pc version of tiktok you just log in at tiktok you can watch your uh chat from there second option is the option i love to do when i go live is that when you're using the screen sharing mobile gaming you want to be able to just plug in something like some earbuds that can have a mute button on that microphone i plug in some uh a basic gaming headset and i plug it under and then I just mute the microphone, the gaming hits, and I kind of just keep the phone right here with me so I can just engage and look at like what's going on. Now, like what I say, you don't get to see the chat on both options. You don't see the TikTok chat and the Twitch at, uh, chat. The one you're going to see is a Twitch chat, whatever is on your phone. So all you will do is hit that mobile gaming. Make sure it is a mobile gaming that you're sharing. If not, they can really provoke that access from you and uh, just do that. Or you can just share like some Xbox gameplay just on from the Xbox app. Just anything you want to share, you do that. But most likely people want to share their twitch stream and what you could do is you could put it in landscape mode so it shows it the long format and then under it will be the chat that's a little bit more of a intermediate feature the first one's going to be advanced with the stream key this is more the immediate with this when you're doing the the mobile game the, the mobile gaming and the screen sharing there's a huge 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 things that you need to look into if you're a twitch affiliate already you're not allowed to be uh, streaming at the same time on different platforms. Now, some people don't care about it. Some people are really, really uh, careful on that contract. So just that's just kind of your call on how you want to do it. Or you just you just don't accept the affiliate contract and just go ahead and stream wherever you want at the same time. So definitely look into that. Those are options you want to look into. And last but not least is going to be the one that and, and with the with the with the mobile gaming, the screen sharing. I don't know how much followers you need. I have that option. Some people have more followers than me and don't have that. Like I could have said, it's just criteria for tiktok just kind of randomly like just throws them out to people and lets people be able to try out these beta features or these newer features so keep double checking your live feed and seeing if you have that on that plus button like if you're going to post a video and go around and then of course there's going to be the last option which is just going quote unquote going live in general now you have to get real unique with this you don't want to just show yourself like live and then playing games and then not even reading your chat um you can go stream and i would suggest maybe putting your phone like back here and to where it shows you actually playing your game and actually like showing you live stream, maybe with some music in the background, plug it in. Like if you can get real unique with the live feature, you can really promote yourself and your stream. So that one's not really quote unquote streaming on that feature, but it's definitely promoting your stream in a cool way. So I would put my phone like way back here and show like your actual monitor, show your camera, show like the process of it. People like to watch the process of things. So show everybody like all the lighting and the game you're playing. And then you can pull up on another monitor or another TV, whatever you're streaming on. And you can pull up your TikTok chat. That really does 
does help so you can read your TikTok chat. So while your phone's back here, giving it a cool like angle of all the lighting and every all the full setup you have, your gaming, your PC, you're rocking. It looks really fresh. It's real transparent, and people like to look at stuff like that. They'll either compliment the setup, the room, or if it gives it like a cozy feel from a different point of view, and people want to check that out, and that you can be able to just they'll trip out because your phone's gonna be behind you, and they'll see that you're still kind of answering the chat. So like it, it's just it's a cool scenario that really helps out. I wouldn't suggest just putting the phone right in front of you just because unless you're just going to do a full on chat. But since you're going to be gaming and streaming, like you want to focus on the game and then just kind of periodically look at the Twitch, uh, the TikTok chat. So, yeah, I'd put the phone like maybe behind you and like give you a whole angle to your audience of your gaming setup, what you're doing, putting on music, getting live, talking to Twitch chat. So that that kind of cross promotes both ways, man. That's kind of the options right there. What I would give on how to stream on TikTok. Uh, one is getting your actual legitimate uh, stream key. Two is the the game, uh, the mobile gaming screen sharing option, which like what I said, it takes a few virtues, meaning muting that echo volume, and then also just finding a different way to read the chat. Third is gonna be just going live, just how everybody else goes live. And then just putting your phone back here and get a good angle. And, then, and also just uh, all these have different requirements of followers and engagement rates. So just check sporadically and see if you have these options and take advantage of these options because they really push the live feeds a lot on TikTok. TikTok has organic reach and more, man. So if y'all want any more videos like this, please leave some comments in the comment section below. It really does help. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and say what's good to your boy, man. We have all of our stuff in the comments in the description box below, all over our banner. Come by, get involved. Also join the Discord and uh, hit us up on TikTok also, man. I appreciate y'all. Y'all have a good one. Peace.